why were the U.S. labs and the U.S. hyperscalers not doing what DeepSeek were doing, right? If, if you think about it through that lens, right, you end up at a completely different place. So were they not doing it because they could not do it? Or were they not doing it because they were doing something else more valuable? The answer is the last, right? The limiting factor in China is access to GPUs. So they had what they had and they worked within that, right? So they were optimizing what they had. U.S. hyperscalers have as many GPUs as they want. They can build clusters all day long. The limiting factors are power to some extent, some water cooling issues, some components, but they can do whatever the hell they want. So the reason why U.S. hyperscalers were not as far advanced as China is because their incentives were not to be, right? So their incentives were to scale fast, build out, deploy, get access to these things when they weren't easy to get because they were all running towards the same finish line at the same time, that has changed, and we're going to go into that because that is insanity as well. 